All right, now, Tim, I've shown you Will Ramos, Will Ramos's vocal uh, playthroughs yep. from Lorna Shaw. He has the incredible growls and snorts and the... Yep. <laughs> it sounds like he has simultaneously swallowed a cheetah and a warthog. Yes. Yep. Uh, more recently, he has swallowed... I don't know. What's something very smooth and delicious? A Barry White. A Barry White. <laughs> and uh, he's teamed up with Nick Nocturnal, a uh, guitarist, YouTuber, God, and they have done a cover of Sleep Token's Rain of Take Me Back to Eden. Okay. So I have heard the song and I loved it, but they've now released a video. So I'd love to see so Will singing this. Let's do it. For so I thought those were headphones for a second. So oh, yeah. Almost became, what a voice. Just mm. a stoic statue fit for nobody. I don't want to get in your way. But I finally think I can see that the vicious side Cause over the moment you smiled at me. He's not allowed to sing and scream like that. It's not fair. It's not it? fair. No. And just like the rain, you cast the dust into nothing and watch all the So Nick would be doing all of the musical parts for this, and he just gets guitar tones perfectly. So it Ready. I've got that at home. Yeah. NTX, right? Nice. Sorry, MPK. It's that chemical cup that I can get down with up like the moon and out like the hounds. A dangerous disposition somehow reflected in light, reflected in sound. So. <laughs> Sounds so chunky. Yeah, dude. I think Nick's actually got his own tone pack now because he just dials it in so well. Why are the frets fanned like that? Aristides just do fancy stuff like that. I don't know if um, I don't know what the science is behind it. Maybe it's easier to sweep or something. Maybe. home studio cover the sound is so huge is this a cover yes cover of sleep token the last time you showed me the live version of his incredible song that went viral. Yeah. We copped a lot of crap for City Sala for almost all of it. Oh, to the Hellfire? Yeah. What, what could you possibly say when I you know. see that for the first time? It's because I'm just hypnotized by the guy. Like, it's I just, wild. Uh, I'm trying to figure out what he's doing to make that sound. I'm looking at how he's... Like, how he's projecting, how he's angling, what he's doing with his mouth. It's I'm, crazy. I feel like I'm getting a masterclass just watching his, like, the way he's positioning yeah. his head and stuff. Like... He is wild. It's amazing. All right. That was crazy. I had, think I know why the frets are fan. Why? 
Because the lever of your arm goes like this, uh, right? So yeah. So in theory, when you're doing a bar chord, hang on, where do over here? Oh no, it's not going to work with the cameras. Yeah, yeah. like as it's angled that way, and then you yeah. put it in that way. Like, I think you're right. I don't know how. Yeah, I don't know how it works with the tuning and everything, yeah. but fancy guitars have that. So I'm gonna like pull the neck off my Stratocaster and put on one with a fence. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I was going to just rip the things off and glue them on angles. Did it work? <laughs> it looks so cool. 